everybody, Troy Ryder from TTMFTW.com, and this is Troy's TTM Thursdays at 3. It uh, was kind of a slow week this week, so don't have too many things to show you, and what I do are, are Ebays, but I have like this special uh, video I'm going to insert here and show you, so uh, hopefully that'll make up for some of it. First to the TTMs, uh, first I did get a hockey player, a hockey return from Johnny Boychuk. And I showed this on my video earlier this week. Uh, he signed in blo blo blue Sharpie. As you can see, Jay Boychuk 55. Uh, this was actually a 124 day return. And that's pretty much because uh, of the NHL lockout. They probably just got their mail, I'm guessing. He plays for the Boston Bruins who just beat... Uh, another team that I was riding, the Carolina Hurricanes, uh, last week. <laughs> um, he's been with the Bruins since 2008, and before that he was with the Avalanche. So, uh, Boston, Boston, I lost my car keys. So, that's pretty neat. Uh, the other real TTMs that I got in uh, uh, were from Matt Schaub from the Texans football team. Uh, I got two of them, as you can see. They were both signed in black Sharpie, obviously, and have his number eight right there. This one was a 77 day return, and uh, they came out pretty nice. You know, those Rookies and Stars cards, uh, I, I thought maybe I'd have to prep them, but these, these came out really nice. There's a little bit of streaking, like when it passes upon itself, but that's kind of to be expected. So those turned out really nice. Um, yeah, I'm really happy with those. So on to, well, I guess there was one other real TTM. I had worked with a celebrity named Jesse McCartney back when he was on a, in a teeny popper band <laughs> called Dream Street. And I actually went and I got an eBay of him. And I was like, you know what? I'm just going to email his mom. And so his mom sent me a photo. Um, so this is the eBay one. And this one, is, it's actually in blue Sharpie. And you could definitely tell that this one's real. Um, he doesn't sign younger pictures of him very often. So that's kind of why I got this one. Because this is pretty much uh, the way I remember him when he uh, worked with us. I actually did his website for a long time before uh, we switched it over to Disney. And so this is the one that his mom sent me and I'm looking at it. I actually had to mail back and ask if it was real because the texture and the light really matches the photo on the signature. Um, she says it is, uh, but he writes much love on almost everything. So it's kind of hard to tell. I was hoping for it to be personalized, but hey, what can you do? Um, so that's cool. So I got the eBay and then the one from his mom. So, and then I thought I was on a, a good streak and I wrote, got another TTM in. Um, I'll save that one for last, but, uh, and then eBay purchase Noah Wiley. Uh, this is a stereotypical signature. Um, it'll go nice in my Falling Skies collection. Um, I met Noah a few times, uh, including uh, a live episode of a or a live movie that George Clooney did called Failsafe, but I never got an autograph, so I wanted to add that to my collection. Now this next one is actually one that I want to take time to mention because I was really excited when I received this in, and that is Shia LaBeouf. Uh, I wrote a really nice letter uh, mentioning a lot of things that we used to do. I used to hang out with Shia at events back in California before. I came back to Iowa back when he was doing Even Stevens, if anybody remembers that, hopefully you do. And so I was really happy to get this one back. Um, so I was like, Zane, I got Shia back from the Ride of Star address. Well, <clears throat> Ben Martinez, B-Mart, as we know and love him, uh, sent me a message that and said, hey, this is probably auto pen. And I was skeptical, but then I looked at what he had, the link he had given me, and I was like, you know, that really does look like an auto pen. It looks like the exact same thing. So I want to show you what I did. 
hopefully this turned out and uh, I'll narrate kind of what's going on. It's not that long, but I just thought I'd show you uh, what I did to verify that yes, this was an auto pen. And it should have been obvious if I would have looked at it more because it was just too perfect. So let's just look at that right now. So here we are. And this is my photo that I got back. So what I'm gonna do is just kind of zoom in and select the black text of the signature and copy that to a new document. And then I'll just highlight that. And so I just get the signature here. There we go. And copy that to my clipboard and then open up the photo that I wanna compare it against which is this one, and I'm just gonna paste it over top for right now, after I zoom in a little bit. So, yep, zooming in. And I'm just going to paste the new one. I'll move it over so we can see it here. And let's just go ahead and paste that in here. Okay, so there's mine on top of the other one and already you can see the similarities but I'm just gonna move this I'm gonna hook up so the T is in the same spot and then just start scaling it down that looks kind of close so then I'll, I'll rotate it to get it a little better oriented here <clears throat> See if, see if that's pretty close. So there it is, move it down. Okay, I'm good. already you can see the, <laughs> the similarities, but I'll scale it a little bit more. Wow, that's really close. Look at that. <laughs> um, let me, as soon as I get this just a little bit closer, let me go and move this in so you can actually see the whole thing. Let's see. There we go. That's pretty darn close there. So you can see how even the strokes are, but even more than that, you can see that my signature directly overlays his, the other photo. So it is an auto pen. Uh, he, you know, I remember talking to a lot of the people that I knew and said, never use auto pens because these are your fans. And obviously Shia um, did not follow that advice or I don't know, but he is a big popular star now, but it's still disappointing um, that I wrote such a awesome personal letter referencing things that we had done and I still get an auto pen, but he may have never even seen it, who knows. So those are pretty much my TTMs for the week. Again, it was pretty much just the fake Shia, the auto pen Shia. Uh, Matt Schaub and Johnny Boychuk were the only real TTMs. It's been kind of slow, but I haven't sent anything out in about a month. So um, with spring training and baseball coming up and hockey finally getting started, I'm gonna try to get some of that stuff out. So uh, thanks again for watching. I hope you enjoyed the demonstration of Shia's auto pen investigation and uh, next week I'll try to put a little bit more together about the autographs if I get any in uh, about who they are and, and things like that rather than just saying oh they're a hockey player so anyway thanks again um, had a great time on autograph weekly last week hopefully I can help I don't know um, if I did okay <laughs> I haven't heard from Zane since we recorded that. So anyway, thanks again, and we'll talk to you later. All right, bye-bye.